In this video, I want to show you how to cascade in IC4017 to make an LED chaser with 17 channels. The single 4070 IC can drive in 10 LEDs only. So if you need more than 10 channels, you have to connect two of them together. However, about one year ago, I made 81 LED channels by using only two 4017 IC. But in some applications, you need to connect the cathode of all LEDs to the ground. This is my circuit. Let's see how this circuit works. In the first, when you connect the battery or power supply to the circuit, the first channel lights up the first LED. At this time, because the base of these two transistors connected to the last channel of the first IC, and because the voltage at this channel is low, so the PNP transistor switched on and guiding the clock pulses to pin number 14 of the first IC. So the LEDs lights up one by another. At this time, the last channel of the first IC become high. So PNP transistor switched off and NPN transistor switched on and start to guide in the clock pulse to pin number 14 of the second IC. So the LEDs at the second IC start to light up one by another. Then the last channel in the second IC, which connected to the reset pin number 15, reset both ICs. And this process repeating again and again. I used the 555 IC as a clock pulse generator. This RC network used to reset both IC at the beginning when you switched on the circuit by making a short pulse. This 1K resistor used to protect the LEDs by limiting the current. I convert this circuit to PCB, then I went to PCBWay.com and made an order. After about two months, I received my package. Then I soldered the components on the PCB. And as you can see, it's working. I can adjust the flashing speed by this potentiometer. This circuit working with voltage range from 5 volt to 15 volt. This decoupling capacitor is very important. I forgot to put it on the PCB. See what happened when I disconnect this capacitor. The last LED jump into the second LED and the first LED doesn't work in. That's because of noise and ripple voltage that come in from the power supply. So this capacitor filter out any noise in the power supply and helps the circuit working well. If you want to order this PCB, click on the first link below in the description of this video. Click add to cart, then select the PCB color and quantity. Then click submit and complete the payment. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.